water since we've been here. I've been here about for the last 18 months, if not more. What stage is it at at the moment? Well, you've been here about it for 18 months, but we've actually been working on it for the last three years and with all the different um, you know, stakeholders that go with it. Uh, a lot has happened. I mean, we've got to a stage now where we're putting in the largest part of the planning application. There's about 15 or 16 million square feet of floor space, huge scheme, huge amount of documents, and it's and it's now finally got to a point where it's gone in. How much work did it take to, to actually get that? Well, this sets new precedents. I mean, first of all, it's now the largest application in the United Kingdom, and of course it's bigger than anything I've ever submitted as well. A big learning curve for the team, for World Council, English Heritage, CABE, everybody that's been involved with this scheme has been you know, amazed at its scale. But if you don't actually design a scheme from the very beginning to accommodate the, the enormous of it all then you'll never get it right when we first did the vision it had tall buildings all over the scheme and there was no real order to it what we've now got now is the the taller of the buildings are now in the center of the scheme and you've got this like pyramid effect now as it goes down towards the the uh, the outer edges so you've got this sort of hill effect where the tall buildings are in the middle so that if you like they cast the shadows on the water and it actually looks really impressive now so yeah it's reduced in scale but it looks a better scheme. At the same time you're doing a similar scheme in uh, Liverpool, a huge task to be taking on. It is. I mean, both schemes have got the name Waters in them to give this, this synergy that's always been there between these two docks. But to my mind, it's one scheme. The centre of the River Mersey is the centre of these two developments, but the two developments work together. And the two teams that are working on this, they actually do collaborate as well. So we make sure that we, we take account of when these two schemes are all completed and built and running together. Uh, Liverpool Waters is about three months behind. We're working well with Liverpool Council and Cape and English Heritage. Part of it is a World Heritage site and that's got the issues that we need to overcome. But I think with everybody working hard together, within the next three months we'll have this boxed off and that should be in as a second application. People seem to take risks when, when you come with these developments. Do you think, do you think that's right? Uh, yeah, it's, it probably is right. I suppose we're, we're gambling in a, in, a, in a sense, but because we're a private company, we, we can take risk. You know, we don't have to worry about short-term measures, and we're not on the stock exchange. We don't have to worry about dividends, so we can take a long-term view. I mean, Salford Keys. We looked at Salford Keys 20 years ago, and you look at it now with the War Museum and Media City and Lowry Centre. These are dock systems, just like Birkenhead docks and Liverpool docks, that we've worked on for 20 years, and they're probably only halfway through the development cycle. They've had a few recessions, and so will these two sites. We're in one now. We'll come out of it. You say it's a risk. I don't think it's a risk. We will stick with it, and we'll move this through, and we'll do it very carefully, and we'll do it with the local pop population, and we'll make sure that there's jobs for local people, not just for people from all over the place. It'll gradually bring itself together, and I think people in Liverpool and Wirral will be very proud of what we've done but it'll take a number of years. I've got the belief in, in both of these schemes. You know, I'm determined to make them work. We're dealing with some very clever people that have got a mindset to make it work. And the Liverpool and World people are, are, are right behind us. So let's just go for it, but be patient.